Hello folks, this is year 2011, May, June, paper 1, 2, and the question number is 24, and it's related to the chapter deformation of solids. As you can see from the question, it is concerned with the springs. So the, the diagram shows the structure of a part of a mattress. So the mattress is a large thing. So there are several springs uh, in parallel as well as three. So these three things are in parallel, and uh, uh, this arrangement, this arrangement is in series with this arrangement. The manufacturer wants to design a softer mattress, one which will compress more for the same load. So softer matri mattress means one which will compress more for the same load. That means its E will be large. E will be large, E or X we can say. And it also means that it also means that its key will be small. Key is the spring constant and it should be small. Overall spring constant should be small. So which change will not have the desired effect? So we have to find uh, some uh, answer to some sort of negative question here. And these uh, questions are always very, very confusing. So it says that which change will not have the desired effect? That means uh, E should not be large, E should not be large, and K should not be small. K should not be small. So let's check. So using more layers of spring, more layers of spring means that we will be adding these things over here, 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 and here. So since the load applies from here, load applies from here, these uh, uh, arrangement will be in series. So these arrangements will be in series. And in series means that, uh, in, in case of series arrangement, we always have, uh, uh, in a series, uh, in series we have uh, 1 by k total is equal to 1 by k1 plus 1 by k2, which gives us k total is equal to k1, k2 by k1 plus k2, this is series. And in series, this k will decrease. This kt will decrease. So kt decrease means that it will be large and uh, again the, 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 the mattress will be softer. So we have to find answer for this, for, for the negative one. So this is not correct. Next is using more springs per unit area. So more springs means that we'll be using for this area, we'll be adjusting more springs here. More springs here. So that means we are adding more springs in parallel we are adding springs in parallel so that's why in parallel we have got k total is equal to in parallel we have got is equal to k1 plus k2 so that's why kt increases increases and e decreases e decreases so we have to have e not large and k uh, not small so here we have got e decrease e becoming smaller so this could be correct answer this could be correct answer so let's go for others also using springs with a smaller spring constant so we have to use uh, uh, springs with smaller keys so smaller key means that the overall key will also decrease overall key decrease so it is the same as uh, number one so this is also not the answer and then in number d we have using springs made from wire with a smaller young smartler so we say uh, that we have to use y is small so if y is small then what we have is y is equal to f uh, l by a e so i have used a stress by strain and read as something so which gives us e is equal to f l by y a so that means if y is small if y is small y is small we'll have e is large e is large so e is large so that means this is again not the answer because the answer requires that e is small and k is large so, E small and K large is only choice number B. So, choice number B should be the correct answer. So, when uh, there are questions uh, which uh, tell you um, uh, the choice about a negative thing, uh, you have to uh, be a bit careful because it uh, often leads to wrong answers. So, you have to be a bit, uh, bit uh, conscious about the answer choices.